Matia Valley and Naperville Central are hoping to get a round of golf in on a wet and rainy Monday, but a significant downpour causing flooding in various spots made things difficult for the golfers. So that forced a stoppage of play, and now the teams tee off for a new round of nine at Orchard Valley on a sunny Tuesday afternoon. On hole one, Central Zach Boyton uses that day two momentum with the chip from the near bunker that takes a fast roll and slows up in time to go in for the birdie. What a way to start one under. Matt Sims gets off to a good start with the fairway shot that lands on the green at the same time as teammate Joe Cerny's. Sims golfs around a 40. Speaking of Joe Cerny, here he is lining up his ball for par, and he makes it. Staying on the first hole and more Red Hawks continue to flap their wings. Clayton Schaefer is the next contestant with the par and goes on for a strong round of 39. Matias Patrick Davis also starts his day even and finishes with a 40. To hole 6 and Mustang Charlie Flaherty's tee shot lands on the green and takes a small favorable roll. Flaherty pars it in from there. Zach Boyton continues to swing away in his strong outing. The tee shot takes a big bounce that inches near the pin and he sinks another birdie. That helps him to a 38, his best round so far. Back to Cerny who also gets a good shot off the tee and his ball lands far from the pin but stays on the green. Cerny leads the charge with a score of 36. More central golfers with a good showing. This time it's Aiden Schultz who pars it in and finishes the day with a 41. We finish the par 3 with Raheel Shaw from Atia who pars the hole and goes on for a 39. Flaherty is lined up for a super long birdie on the ninth hole. He thinks the tap will do the trick, but it just comes up short. He still ends his round with the same score as Shaw with a 39. They always say save the best for last, and that's the case for Kyle Bucher who birdies and maintains his score of 41. Even with the late surge, the Hawks keep their good performance rolling with the Graham Cavanaugh par. Central takes it by six strokes despite the Mustangs golfing their best team score of the season. I'm really happy, yeah. Uh, I've not been playing too hot lately, so this is a round to really like kick my uh, school career off. It's really helpful, you know. Uh, it also gives me a few things to work on, like, you know, still playing well, there's always things to work on in the out off season, so yeah, should be good. This golf course is new for a lot of guys. A lot of guys haven't seen it, so I think it's a good test of golf, and I think a lot of guys played all right. I think we got to start a little better. I think our team struggles like off the tee early. Um, I think in that range, starting off better, holes one through four especially. 